off the mark straight away. Play with soft hands. A little bit of swing on offer with the new ball. And good movement again. You we'll also have to take note of that due factor whether. Again, he's uh, able to close that angle of offering no width to his stop. Oftentimes, you see new ball bowlers bowl that test length you often talk about that finishes on the top of off. Five dots in a row. Excellent first over from Aspen Wall. It's one for none. Tallest of bowlers with the Sam. Might not do so. Fine stroke. Chase up. Just squeezes this one past cover point for a four. Good end to the over. After two, eight without loss. Full and a bit of width offered by Ibtisam. And Shazeb Khan was on it very quickly. Good shot to end the over and take the pressure back to the gi Giants. Aspen Wall. Great skills on display. Just going down the leg side, but good full. That's a good take by the wicket keeper. And this is the area where the Giants do not have a lot of leeway. They don't have enough runs on the board, so they have to keep the extras in check. The ball is swinging, but they have to do it from a good area. The problem with Shahzeb Khan is that his front leg is not going towards the ball. He's, he's playing from very far behind. That's why not being able to connect, just that front foot is not going towards the ball. Was airborne for a while but a firm enough stroke through that cover region this will release a lot of the pressure being built up by the bowlers second boundary for him in the cover region not 100 percent in control but effective there was a chance but the field it just went into the gap important boundary they are getting boundary every over gone for it again wide of that field in deep third that's good going by Shazeb 10 from the over three gone 18 without loss and even though he does not have a lot of feet movement but he has got really fast hands and that's why he's been able to connect these deliveries this time he actually knew where the fielder was and played it in the gap Short with pace, but goes in no man's land. All across the seam. Got the pace, got the bounce. But the field was not there. The fielder, there was no short mid-wicket. Chance for a run out. Direct hit would have been a goner. The overall energy in the field has been really good. From both teams. This time, trying for that run out good commitment there but couldn't hit the stumps could only see one stump from there so not an easy angle will he go hard length or will he go to Yorker to finish the over off hard length into the pitch but a little too short a little too high that's fast and that's high the square leg umpire will just uh, assess the height of the ball there 
definitely above waist height. He will have to bowl that one again as well, and that too a free hit. Yeah, I'm with you. Clearly above the waist. Offside. With pace on. Gets away with it. Ends the fourth over. 28 without loss. Captain Mumtaz now with the ball. He will want to follow that fine effort with the bat. Get an LBW if he can with the arm ball coming in from the angle. He's stumping. Couldn't hold on. Taking the pressure on as a captain, but Hasnain Majid not able to connect, collect that one. He was a goner. Shazib Khan gave the chance. Was searching for the single, couldn't get there. Another the dot to end the over. 24 of those dots in the first power play, and that was the real problem. Yeah, some of them have been in the under-19 World Cup circuit. Some of them have represented their country at the under-19 level. Some of them fairly new. Big shot. He cleared the inner field for sure. And probably the first maximum as well. First six of the game, first six of Pakistan Junior League. It was short, he saw it. Just got his uh, hip out the way so he could swing the bat flat back over the bowler's head. And it's actually hit quite high up on the bat to be able to get that much distance. This time a top edge, catch it is the call, but it will land in safely, one bounce. The pace just carries it all the way. Yeah, Sean's a stubborn one. He's gone for six over his head, the ball before. He's tried it again, and I'll tell you what, it's a good bouncer. Because he hasn't got the connection he wanted this time. That clearly bouncing inside the boundary wedges. And so four runs will be signaled. Again, a good shot, just over. Another boundary, that's a big over this. 16 of it, power play comes to an end, 45 for no loss, Martha Warriors. How's this for a cricket stroke? A couple of forceful strokes to the balls before, this time slightly over pitched. And just the check drive over Madon, he was interested for a while but it was way over his head. Boundary to end, a very good over, 16 from it.